Hello everybody, it's Crafting Mint MC here with another bucket tutorial, and I have with me here today DR Soth. <laughs> okay, okay then. Uh, and the plugin today we are going to be showing you is Gravestone. So, since DR Soth's mic is a little bad, then I will demonstrate this plugin for you. So, would you just stand right there, DR Soth? Stand right there. There you go. Are you ready? There you go. Mm. Oh no! Look at that! He just he just died right on the spot. And as you can see, it spawned a really nice little thing here. And if you do this, oh my goodness, it has a chest with all of his crap. He was holding a sign, apparently. There you go. So let's just break this. That, 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 that. Okay. So let's just, um, so that's basically the whole plugin, but it's also got some config options, so let me just drag that into the screen right now, okay? Let me just cover up the Minecraft window. Now, let's just see here. So, only build grave on natural materials, so that's like, so people can't, like, grief structures by going into someone's house and then dying, and then making, like, their house a grave, and... That stuff, and this is enable fancy grave. Now, basically, what the fancy grave is is the grave with the chest in the bottom and stuff like that. And the fancy grave material is dirt, and we will be messing around with some of this later. Okay. And the side decor is the red flowers that appeared on the side last time. Uh, uh, yes. So that's the side decor. So I'm just let's let's just change these right now. Let's make this like brick, and this say like uh. Uh, let's see, side decor, leaf, no, uh, yellow flower, sure, see if that works. Create buried inventory chest, so that's like the chest, it had a scrap in it. Uh, display time and date of death, so it makes that side on there. Uh, allow grave in all the world, so if you want graves in the end and stuff like that too. Uh, that's basically that, so if I just go ahead and save that file real quick, okay, I go back here, oh my god! No, 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 no. Oh, oh god, he's, 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 okay, there you go, okay, so just stand right on this block right here, buddy, right on that sandstone, there you go, Nothing. nothing's gonna go bad, buddy, just sit right there. Oh no! Whoa! So as you can see, it has bricks and yellow flowers now. Um, that, yeah, I really like this plugin, so you can actually tell he died May 28th. is the actual day, 2013. I think that'd be kind of cool, like, if you just saw the, uh, you just, like, join the server or something like that, and then you're like, whoa, somebody died here, like, literally two years ago. Stuff like that. Also, one of my favorite parts is it actually puts the flower on brick. So, uh, it's kind of stupid, but like it, it's like a block update switch. So what plugin is this then? This is the gravestone plugin, and I will have the uh, permission nodes uh, in the uh, description and stuff like that. But I'll also go over some of them right now. So let me just look at them for a second here. Okay, I think there's permission notes, aren't there? No? Doesn't look like there's any permission notes. Here, let me de you to yourself. Okay. Here, take these flowers. Okay, stand over here, please. Okay, let me just kill you once more. Okie dokie. Wow, he died twice, like, at the same spot. So, say something to yourself. So it doesn't look like there's any permission nodes, I stand mistaken on that. But there's just a config, and uh, so that's pretty much the whole plugin. Uh, thanks for watching, you should probably get this plugin for your server, because it's amazing. And, uh, yeah. See you later. Be sure to subscribe.